Hello everyone. This is video number five um, to help you complete the quarter three performance assessment. So far, if you've made it this far, you have completed all of part A. So in the first couple of videos, we went over what this PA is about. And then in our last video, we found what the budget was for the Early Learning Center's playground. For me, the fence will cost $13,974. The grass I'm going to use, I decided to use real grass, which was $18 per square foot. The grass will be $777,600. So my total budget is going to be seven hundred ninety one thousand five hundred seventy four dollars the elementary school complex is looking at building a similar playground and has three times the budget how much do they have to spend for the elementary school's playground so if they have three times the budget i'll take the budget i have for the elc seven hundred ninety one thousand five hundred seventy four and multiply it by three this is $2,374,722. Now we're going to move on to Part B. Part B. The elementary school has a budget of... Part B. The elementary school has a budget of uh, $2,374,722. They wonder if they can build their playground by scaling up the ELC's playground by three. Create a labeled scaled dilation drawing of what this would look like using a scale factor of three and point A as the center. You may create your dilation on GeoGebra, then import an image on, image on paper or on the Jamboard. So I'm going to recreate this ELC playground in GeoGebra. Now I'm going to create the diagram for the ELC playground. I'm going to show major grid lines and then I'll plot my points. I'm going to go back to the QPA to figure out where the points are again. So A and then B is four to the right. C and D. Okay. So four to the right, and then C is eight above A, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. D is right here. E is in between, and F is right there. So now I'm going to connect these segments. Now what I want to do is actually create a pentagon connecting A, C, D, F, and then back to B. This is because I am going to dilate this pentagon, this five-sided figure that represents the ELC playground with a dilation of three. So I'm going to go to more and I'm going to go all the way down and I'm going to dilate from a point. I'm going to dilate this figure with the center at point A. Now I'm going to type in my scale factor of three and I'm going to have to zoom out because this is what my new playground is going to look like. Let me center it right here. I'm going to take a picture of this and actually what I want to do is I'm going to um, find the dimensions of this right now. I'm going to find the distance 
of this side length. The perimeter is 81.9. Here are the dimensions of my first figure. And then I'm going to find the area. The area of the uh, dilated figure is 432 square units. So I'm going to move that. Right here. Now I'm going to go to my QPA. I can click this and eliminate it. I can also eliminate that and just erase that. And I'm going to input a picture from my photos. Here we go. And that is all I want you to do for today. That's it.